Okay guys, welcome back to my channel, and if you're probably wondering on the last episode, actually this is another episode on my creative city, we're gonna explore the third one today, but before I start the intro, if you're wondering why I'm bringing this amazing sword, is that if I put some, if I use some blocks or just my normal fist, if I accidentally break, I I accidentally, accidentally break blocks, so if I have a sword, even though how long I press it, it doesn't break a block. So let's hit the intro first. Okay, so as I said, um, today we're gonna, I'm gonna give you a tour on the third and last city. This was on the uh, previous episode and now let's go back here let's go back to the first city just wait a minute wait a minute okay so as you can see here this road is going through is divided here so we're gonna take this path this path actually this build took me days to yes to build and nobody is driving through it. There's only me in this world. Maybe how to turn this into serve into a server? Can I turn this world into a server? Let me know in the comments down below, guys. Okay, so we've arrived on the third city, as you can see. The world's still loading. It's a bit laggy. There's lots of buildings and stuff there. So, but first, let's explore this first. This first building here is... A lab, a laboratory, laboratory, no, laboratory. I just designed it for no reason uh, at all. I just love laboratories. As you can see, there's some books here with an emerald. Oh yeah, I forgot, this, this was the time stone. You know, the time stone from Doctor Strange. And also we have a pathway here, which, which says to the nether entrance, okay. Let's go through the entrance. Let's go to the nether. And then when we go to the nether, we have another facility here. Nether facility. But actually, it's unfinished. I'm so sorry, guys. It's just a tube here. Like a tube. Then, there we go. We're out of the facility. Yes, that's all of it. Let's go back to the overworld. Wait, is that the overworld? Oh yeah, it's the overworld. Let's go back. Okay, if you go back here, you spawn... Oh my gosh. Okay, so if you go back here, you spawn back on the first city. That's why there's a nether portal on top of this building. So let's go back to the city again. Oh my goodness. Two hours later. Okay, we're back. After many miles, many miles. So this is Captain America's suit. See that? Steve Rogers, aka Captain America. I just designed that because I want to have fun. Nanotech currently under development. Yes, that is nanotech. And here we have... Oh, I forgot to put the sign there. This is T'Challa, aka Black Panther's armor, as you can see. Yeah, it's purple. It, it, uh, the color was purple, by the way. Here we have a beautiful view. And we have some Iron Man suits. Yes, Iron Man suits, seriously. Mark, are you a fan of Iron Man? Yes, I'm a fan of Iron Man. So this is Mark 1, Mark 2, Mark 3, Mark 4, Mark 5, Mark 6, Mark 7. I just don't. Just never mind, guys. <laughs> Further here, we have the lab area the lab area this is where we test some animals actually no animals were hurt in the making of this video this is carl hi carl how are you carl yes i named him carl when i started building this city i mean this building this is the first building in this in this city and a rabbit was trapped inside here so i named him carl for no reason at all 
It's not Carl the YouTuber. The YouTuber? Yes, the YouTuber. Okay, too much of the Carl thing. We have here a jelly house. We have some mail. Oh yeah, we have some mail. We have some fan art and some flowers. Actually, if you step this pressure plate, step on this pressure plate. See? Oh, can you hear that? Can you hear that? Wait, wait a second. Okay, check this out. Check this out. See? Can you hear that? Okay, the, too much of that doorbell thing system. If you enter that, it sounds really... There's a sound. Sound is going to be produced. This is the golden swimming pool. As you can see, it has gold. So first, actually, let's give an overall view from the outside. Sugar canes for design. So this is exclusively built for Jelly. I hope Jelly can join this world and play with me. No problem. Why not? So this is the living room. As you can see, we have a table. Actually, it's quite cramped in here. We have some sofas or, you know, the couch. I don't care. I don't care what term I use here. There is a TV with some speakers and, of course, the books. And we have this room is divided by this fence and this is the kitchen we have some utensils no no utensils and this is this the cooking area yes that's where you cook and this is the exhaust this is an aisle which is expandable you can expand the aisle and also underneath the aisle is a storage area Multi-purpose. And we have a sink here. A sink where you wash your hands. 20 seconds. And this is the fridge with no no items inside. And this is where we eat. The table with some tasty steak. Okay, here we have lots of rooms. We have recording studio number one. That is a nice keyboard and a mouse. And we have some speakers and a printer. I don't know why we have a printer here. We have the green screen. Is that a green screen? We have the backdrop so that we can use the chroma key thing. Chroma key. And here we have another PC. Yes, that is the system unit. A diorite system unit. We have another printer there. Never mind. Further on. We have the bathroom. We have the bathtub. Really nice. Some towels. A... What you call this thing? A toilet. And a working shower. Check this out, guys. We have a shower. Oh, yeah. Sorry. There we go. We have a shower. We're not going to be stinky. Oh, come on, dude. Just turn off the shower. I'm going to drown. Hello, how are you? I am under the water. There we go. Let's go back. Oh yeah, I forgot this. We also have the master bedroom here. Check this out. The master bedroom. We have some two body bodyguards in the closet. And of course, you have your personal TV with your book here. And watch and sit and watch and have some what is this milk have some milk you have your fridge here and here we have the library that is a really cool library if you're asking mark why did you come down actually there's a pathway here for the guests this is for the guests so if you have some visitors they should enter here. So this is the guest the guest area of the house. This is the kitchen where the guests can eat. As you can see, amazing aisle or with some storage or like a table thing, you know that? We also have the kitchen. Yes, the kitchen setting. We have the exhaust. We have a double fridge. With no, with yeah, double fridge, empty fridge. 
We also have a small TV with some books and another living room. And there we go. Actually, this is so this is so ironic. Jelly, Josh, and Craner. But uh, Jelly is the tallest of them all. I'm sorry, Jelly. By the way, we also have some flowers here. We also have some flowers. We have the guest bedroom. So let's go to the next house. What's the next house? This is the next house. This is a small house. The smallest house in the game. This is another house. This is, this is just a pure house tour video, actually. This is the bedroom. The toilet. Stairs. The kitchen. There's a lot to cover in this episode, so this is going to be... There's going to be two parts of this. We have here another yellow house. I think this is for Craner, I guess. And upstairs, yeah, just a simple house. Simple house with... And also, this is the only house with a garage. So, special house. Across here, we have a Cobble Cop house. Cobble Cop. Yay, we have an aquarium underneath. As you walk in, that is so beautiful. And we have a couch. Watch some TV. And a kitchen. So if you have some visitors, you can give them some food through here. Oh yeah. Give some food through here. And then you have some items here. Put your items, kitchen utensils, and you can cook here. And also we have the fridge, of course. Upstairs is just a view. Yes, and also a rooftop view. And another rooftop. Oh yeah, that's not a rooftop. This is the bedroom. It's quite cramped. Tight space, but... It's good. It's good. Here, we have a tower. As you can see, this is the tallest structure here, I guess. Or maybe later. This is the tower. It's just a view... Of the whole city. There we go. We have a view of the whole city from here. Good view. And also downstairs, you can see the underside. What's underneath the building? Yes, pretty spectacular. But yeah, I can't get out here. Let's go back. I also use water elevators right now. I use water elevators because it's faster than using ladders. Okay, we're out of the building. Let's continue the tour. Here we have the, before we get to that building, we have a, yeah, this large building. It's called... Jelly Inc. Jelly Incorporated. I'm sorry. This is the reception area. The I am under the water. water. H2O. The meeting area. Yes, the meeting area. That's so cool. I designed this for a week, I guess. It's one week. So hard to make this building. Because I sliced, literally sliced a mountain. So these are the offices. This is the office, of course. It's just one office. And here we have some more water. And the closets. I mean, the, the lockers for the employees. And we have a relaxation area from... You can relax here from the stress when you're at work. Anyway, oh yeah, this is a part of a mount, mountain. Mountain. Here, this part, I just... Kaboom. Kaboom? Yes, Rico. Kaboom. Okay, further here. Let's go this way. Oh yeah, I've, I almost forgot. This space... Space center. 
Check this out. This took me days to build. Actually, as you can see, we have the telemetry telemetry area. You know, you can see the status of the rocket or the mission. Yeah, this is Houston. No, this is not Houston. This is uh, I don't call what I don't know what to call this city. Let me know in the comments down below what should I call this city and give you a free shout out. Okay, so let's go to the space center, actually to the launch pad right now. I built this road special, I mean exclusively for this launch site. I built this launch site and took me weeks to build. I forgot to put a, you know, that swing arm. Okay, we're on the top. So this is the bridge to the rocket. As you can see, you can get a good view from the outside, from the city. And this is the rocket, inside the rocket. This is the Crew Dragon. And this is the, the docking port. Actually, it's closed. Because the, the cone thing is closed. So hard to build this. This is a large rocket, by the way, and we also have the flame trench. This is the flame trench of the launch pad. It's not an accurate version of the Falcon 9, but hey, it looks cool. Look at that. It looks cool, by the way. Here we have a building. This is a commercial building. And we have a mailbox here. Do not open unless you're a slogan man, of course. We have the storage in the first floor. We have the living room. Oh yeah, this this is the kitchen. I'm so sorry. The kitchen on the second floor. You can cook here. Also, we have the toilet. Oh yeah. There are some curtains here so that people won't see you while doing your thing. And on the top... We have a living room and an aquarium. Look at that cute fish, it's red. We have the aquarium here. I mean, the living room, the seats, and the suit. Yeah, Iron Man suit. And on the top, we have a tiny cafe slash bar thing. And also we have the bedroom, of course, the bed. And the TV, the TV, it's the important thing here. And upstairs, the rooftop, we have a couch if you want to watch a rocket. So if I'm, I'm going to cover this area here on the next episode. So make sure you like and subscribe for part two. If you're enjoying this so far, yes, subscribe to my channel. I hope you're all safe and well, and thanks for watching. Bye!